forfeit your win for last year's poll. <laughs> <laughs> so what? So what are what are we on our way to do, guys? Well, apparently, last year's polar bear challenge winner's having a little trouble. He is with his bike, that polar bear bike that won the whole championship. Polar bear. It gave him some trouble, huh? Yeah. For us going to get him, he's going to have to forfeit it. And, and the supposed, like he said, second place guys are rescuing the first place guy? Yeah, isn't that something how that That's, works? Yeah. Huh. That's, yeah. Huh. justice for you, ain't it? I tell you, yeah. But I look at it this way. You can't be in a polar bear now, not if I work on the bike. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, what was his conditions that we helped him? What's he owe you, John? It'll be a large McDonald's coffee of seven sugars. Okay, large McDonald's and, coffee of seven sugars. And forfeit last year's win in the polar bear. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that, that's a good deal, isn't it? Yeah. Sounds fair to me. Yeah, all right. I just think what it is is that Bergman is such a polar bear bike, it can't take the warm weather. It just, it got heat stroke. That's what it did. Probably, probably. Bergman, <laughs> a Bergman with heat stroke, that's what I say. That or maybe his green screen fell down. Oh, the green screen? Yeah, that's true. Yeah, you know, the whole thing yeah. was rigged last year. Of course, it had to be. <laughs> I know the judges were not fair at all. Yeah, us. I know. Yeah, but fair, but fair. But this year, we're going to do so good, the judges can't even cheat That's us. right. Yeah, yeah but... Now, what, what's the bike we're going to put on this ramp now? Is it one of the Rebels? No, it's not a Rebel. a Rebel. Not a Rebel? No. The no. Triumph. I bet you it's a Triumph, right? No, the no? Triumph's good. Oh, they are? Oh, okay. Well, I'm out of guesses, and I wouldn't know what possibly... It's like a birthday present to us. <laughs> <laughs> Christmas. Thank you. Thank you. Didn't this guy Didn't this guy make some kind of joke at the meetup about something? What is he? <laughs> what is that? I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> you jinxed yourself. Yeah, well, uh, uh, Hi, Jen. I can't hear anything, right? Um, I don't know, I can jump on here. Can it move enough to get up the ramp with the, okay. I mean, he's turning around, probably pushing it. Don't ride it. Yeah, yeah, don't ride it up the ramp, just get it lined up. I like if I was riding up that ramp, I'd spin that back tire once the front got on. Yeah, <laughs> that's what Navy Thomas did when he went to get on my trailer. He spun the back tire and dropped it off the ramp. And that BMW is like. Did it ride there? Ride there? Yeah, it'll be fine. All right. Wait. Oh, hell, we got big towns all the way around us. We'll find stuck. So what's what's the final diagnosis we have here, guys, of what the problem was? The right wheel bearing. The right wheel bearing. On the rear tire. And the dealership supposedly, supposedly I say, put two new wheel bearings in it. But we don't agree it with that. like NT8's bike. We don't agree with that. We uh, are pretty much positive that one of the wheel bearings was the one on the right or the left. Right. The one on the it's right old. is an old wheel bearing and they only put one new one on the other side and because of that and the shaft, when we would actually move the tire, we'd actually press on the tire on the bike, and it would actually move just like this. And that's not right. It should have been stable. So our recommendation, if we find a place that has the bearings in stock, take it in and have two new bearings put in, because we don't trust the other new one now with the shaft whipping around like that. Best to put two in. But worst case, you can only get one bearing. Do it right and on file, file like that. Well, after we put it together and make sure, I mean, put it axle with the axle in and see how it feels to us. Yeah. If it still doesn't feel tight, I wouldn't ride it. Whatever. Busted yeah. kneecap, we're fixing it. Yeah. Busted knuckle way east with the NT8 Superstar tearing it down. No thanks to the long-haired hippie freak over there. Yeah. <laughs> he disappeared as soon. You know what? That guy right there. As soon as we started working on it, he was nowhere to be found. Yeah. I heard the I heard the truck fire up and. <laughs> he took I, off and what's that? Next to his right knee. Yeah. He went to Mickey D's. He got hungry. Oh, that's right. He took off from me. He's like, all oh, these guys working on this bird would make me hungry. That's awful. Yeah.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. You take your key with you in that. Or are you sleeping here? Uh, back at the hotel. Yeah, okay. Jenny's over there waiting. I would hope so. Well, if you're it's your anything, tell her you come back. Oh, I'm sure she's passed out already. Yeah. She's tired. The way he's described it, I think it's better just to, yeah, let her relax because she's had a lot of stress today. A lot of stress. Yeah, believe me, yeah. If she would have, if I'd have gone through half of what she's gone through today, I'd have been really pissed off. <laughs> it was not a good day no. for the PBC champion of 2013. No. <laughs> Wait a second, you not just heard it. PBC champion of 2013. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't listen yeah, to them, yeah. They're still trying to, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I told you it was the weather. <laughs> you guys got sidetracked. That's the only reason you got beat. 